I've gotten locked out so many times. How many times a day do someone walk through the door and say, I've been locked out? Two, three times a day. How often do you get locked out? Has it happened? It has happened, and it was really expensive. My system is my brother has my key, um, and my friend Deb has my key, but that means sometimes I'll walk into my apartment and Deb is sitting there watching television. I could use an app. I could, I could try technology. To me, what was really important was not to design something that kind of jumps at you, that looks like a gadget but rather uh, design something that fits with the hardware, the colors, the materials that people expect in their home. It, it happens to all of us at some point, right? You leave your keys at the office, you leave them at a friend's house, you drop them in the seat of a taxi. So two million people a year have to find a way to get into their house. What are the scenarios and how it works with the app? Can you just walk us through it? Sure. So again, this is installed on the inside of your door. The outside of your door doesn't change. So if uh, grandma has a key to the house, or somebody has a key to the house, or your key to the house, it still works. This takes about 10 minutes to install on the inside. There's two different ways to use the product as far as opening and closing. One is manually. I can pull my phone out and connect to the lock and lock and unlock the door. The other one is by setting up auto unlock. The lock will sort of sense me coming Another exciting feature is the fact that you can send a key to somebody virtually. You can just go to your phone book and then you say, here's a key for you to come in. And that's the only time that key is gonna function. What do you say to those people that say, I'm just not sure if I'm secure or if this is safe? Security is our highest priority, right? Right now, if you give a key to somebody, a copy can be made. You never know if a copy was made. Uh, you have to get that key back. So electronically, you know, you give a key, you can revoke it at any time. Now, in regards to it, can it be hacked? Um, so, three things. Number one, Bluetooth has an encryption layer of its own. And then on top of that, August created our own. But even if you cracked both of those security levels, got to the third, we have this code mechanism in which only one code is used each time. So if, even if you got past the encryption layers, you got that code, that code actually wouldn't be of any value to you. It was just that one time. But that was an expensive I mean, that time. was enough, right? I mean, that was <laughs> enough. 200 bucks is enough. That was enough for me twice. to be like, I'm never going to this again.